Welcome to day 11. Yesterday we saw how our loss function measures the distance between what our models predict and reality. But here's the fundamental question. How do we actually minimize that loss? This is where the gradient descent comes in. Gradient descent means that we compute the partial derivatives with respect to our parameters and then move exactly in the opposite direction of that gradient. Think of it this way. You are standing on a mountain in thick fog, trying to reach valley. The gradient tells you the direction of the steepest ascent, so you walk exactly in the opposite direction. Each step follows this rule, where alpha is your learning rate and theta are your parameters. Take linear regression with mean squared error. The gradient with respect to w is given by the partial derivative of this loss function. If this equals minus 0.3, we update our weights like this. We are literally climbing downhill on this loss surface one calculated step at a time. Now, here's a profound insight. This simple rule, follow the negative gradient, is how every neural network learns. From recognizing our faces to translating languages, it's all about gradient descent, finding the bottom of this increasingly complicated loss landscapes. Tomorrow, we will see how this scales to networks with millions of parameters we will learn the back propagation.